we'll start with the last topic of our logical reasoning that is sitting arrangement now what happens in sitting arrangement is basically uh, a particular scenario kind of a situation will be given to us a is sitting on the left side of b b is sitting on the right side of c c is sitting on the left side of d a certain clues kind of a thing and reading those clues we have to form that how is a placement certainly made according to this particular scenario so in order to start with this we need to first learn a couple of we we'll need to learn the meaning of a couple of sentences first supposingly i have a sitting arrangement a b c d e f let's understand for this sitting arrangement this is a linear arrangement everyone is sitting in the linear fashion in a straight line now here i can say a couple of things a and f are sitting in the extreme positions a and f are sitting in the extremes but by this line i haven't given a conclusion that a is sitting on which of the extreme whether a is sitting on the first position or a is sitting on the last position so that is not clarified agree so this is a vague information this is a vague information c is immediate right of b that means wherever b is sitting c is sitting on the immediate right side now this is a specific information this is a specific information e is sitting second to the right of c now again this is a specific information we already know that b and c are sitting here so from c start counting and wherever two comes on the right side place e so this is one this is two on the right side so in the position of two will place e agree online agree yes ma'am yes, b is on the right of a now this right does not mean immediate it can be on the any position on the right side but it gives us one clarity from the first option and fourth option if b is on the right side of a and a is sitting at a corner then a has to be in the left corner online you are do you agree if a and f have to yes. sit on the ends and b is on the right side of a then a cannot be in the right hand side corner b a yes, has to be on the left hand side corner agree yes ma'am yes ma'am so we have already placed four numbers and we know that a and f are in the corners so automatically we already have this location and we know that a and f are on the corners so the only corners are left so it has to be this way there is no option otherwise so who is remaining so we fill up the back blanks now i can ask you anything which are the two persons sitting in the middle e and d e and d, e and d. who is sitting second to the left of f b e. d. d second to the left of f first left second left so d is sitting on the second left of f who are the neighbors of c b and d neighbors are on the both side b and d are both neighbors understood yes yes ma'am now this is a linear arrangement we also have circular arrangement now in case of circular arrangement there is no first position second position third position so in a circle you can make the first person sit anywhere wherever you like but you have to think of two things whether they are looking towards each other or they are looking away to each other if they are looking towards each other they are looking towards the center then for this person this is the right side this is the left side agree 
for this person, this is right and this is left. Agree? That means right is anti-clockwise and left is clockwise. Online, do you all agree? When am I saying this? If you are looking towards the center. If you are looking towards the center, right is in the anti-clockwise direction, left is in the clockwise direction. Agreed? Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma looking away from the center. That means you are looking outside. You are looking outside. Imagine yourself. In this case, this is your left and this is your right. If a person is here, this is left and this is right. So in this case, left is anti-clockwise. Right is clockwise. Understood? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So, for example, if I have a circular arrangement. Ma'am, can you scroll up for Thank you, ma'am. They're looking, nothing is said, they're looking, looking towards the center. Who is sitting opposite to A? B. 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 B is sitting opposite to A. Who is sitting opposite to C? B. D. C. Who are the neighbors of E? Elephant. B. B. C. C. E. E. Who are the neighbors of E? G and C. 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 E and G. Who is sitting third to the left of F? E. Who is sitting third to the e. left of e. him? E. Left is this side, right is this side because they are looking towards the center. One, two, three. So E is on the third of left. Yes, third on the right. A. For F, you are sitting third on the right. A. For F, one, two, three. A is sitting on the third of right of A. Yes. No, no. Right and left. Sir. Online clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma yes, ma you also have a polygon arrangement. Basically, we only have rectangular arrangement or a square arrangement. Ma'am? Yes. In circular arrangement, in the question, if it is not mentioned towards the center or away from towards. this. If toward... nothing is mentioned, it's towards the center. Supposingly, you have a table. Three chairs here. Three chairs here. A, B. They're looking towards each other, obviously. Okay. Who is diagonally opposite to A? F. Yes. F is diagonally opposite to. Who are sitting in the middle seats? B and e. e. B and E. Who will be sitting on the extreme position? Who is sitting on the right side of B? Wrong. Person o. is looking. This side, this is left and this is right. Imagine yourself. So, this is right side A. For E, who is also sitting on the right side? The person is looking here. This is right, this is left. So, F is on the right side? Yes, ma'am. Guys, understood? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, yes ma'am. Ma Okay. Mom? Yes. Uh, can you scroll up once, mom? Mom, for C who's right? Sorry? For C who's left and right? C does C is already in the left corner. 
Mam, for C, capital R is, uh -huh. F is left. For C, F is opposite. Okay, ma'am. So, when they are in the corner most place, we can't tell someone is left or right. This is the left side and this is the right side. B is on the right side of C. There is no left side of C. Okay, ma'am. Is it okay? Yes, ma'am. Anyone else has any doubt? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma Clear till you? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma Try. A is sitting. They are sitting in a room. Huh? A is sitting next to B. But not next to C. C is not sitting next to D. There are four persons A, B, C, D. What are the possible arrangements? D, A, B, C. Okay. A is occupying a seat next to B. So it can be B A or it can be A B. Agree? If A is not sitting with C, then C will be on this side. Yes, ma'am. C is not sitting next to D. So D will be either on this side or it will be on this side. So these are the two possible arrangements. These are the two possible arrangements. Anyone can be true. Online, do you agree? Yes, yes ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma ma P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, and W. They are sitting in a room. First, P is Fourth to the right of T. W is fourth to the left of S. R and U are not at ends. Our neighbors of Q and T respectively. W is next to the left of P. P is the neighbor of Q. Find out the setting arrangement. Mom, when they say W is the next to the left of P. Immediate left. Sorry, mom? Immediate left. Okay. Online done? One minute, ma'am. Yes, ma'am.
हो गया देर आर एट पोजिशन फॉर दिस इज अ स्पेसिफिक इन्फॉर्मेशन विल पुट दिस बुक्स पी इज फोर्थ टू द राइट ऑफ टी सो टी राइट साइड वन टू थ्री फोर सो वी हैव पी हियर अग्री That that W is next to the left of P. So W will be here. Yes. Then they said that yeah. P is neighbor of Q. So if P is the neighbor of Q, Q has to be sitting here. Yes. Any doubts still here? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, no ma'am. Ma next. W is fourth to the left of S. W is fourth to the left of S. So W is on the left side of S and in the fourth position. So this is the fourth position, third, second, first. This should be S. Do you yes, all agree? Yes, ma'am. So all the eight positions are written down now. Now. R is the neighbor of Q, so R will be sitting here. U is the neighbor of T, U will be sitting here. Which letter is left? V, ma'am. V. V. So V will be here. Now they can ask a lot of questions. Who are sitting on the ends? T and L. T and L. W. Who is sitting in the middle? W and P. W and P both are sitting in the middle. Who are the neighbors of W? P and P. P and P. Clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. For the circular arrangement, if I give you, we are talking about eight persons. A to H. We are talking about eight persons, A to H. Okay. First information: four ladies, A, B, C, D. That means the remaining four are gents. Agree? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. The arrangement is circular. Okay. The arrangement is circular. No two ladies. Or gentlemen are sitting together. Or gentlemen are sitting side by side. Third, C. Who? The word who is written for the person who is written near to who? That means you are talking about C here. C who is sitting between G and E. is sitting between g and e he is facing d he is facing d o f is between d and a and facing g h is to the right of the right if nothing is mentioned they are all looking towards the center it's we have eight positions so first we'll draw them symmetrical 1 2 3 4 5 6 
seven and eight. Agree? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, are not very specific kind of we don't need them no this information c who is sitting between g and d is facing d is facing d so if c is here d is here anywhere you can place c anywhere as you like no restriction okay, okay. yes now, who is between G and D? Right now, I'm not sure. Agree? Yes. F is in between D and A. Okay, let's see. I'm making a guess here. G and E. Yes? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. F is between D and A and is facing G. So F is facing G and is between D and A. So A has to be here. All of them are looking towards the center, remember. So this is the left side and this is the right side. Yes, ma'am. Hmm. Now H is to the right of B. So, H will be here, B will be here. Dekh ah, right, M. Yes, but now there is a problem. B and D are both ladies. That means I made a mistake. Agree? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. So where was my mistake? That assumption. Yes, about G and E. Right? Because I had to take a guess. There was no other option. Clear? Yes, ma'am. Ma'am. Removing them now. That means G is here. E is here. Any problem? No. Yeah. Oh, ma'am. D will be sitting here. So, who was facing G? F. F. And F is between D and A? Yes, ma'am. Guys, clear till here? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma towards the center. This is my right side. This is my left side. H is to the right of B. Clear? Yes, ma'am. Ma ladies, gents, ladies, gents, ladies, gents, ladies, gents. Or alternate, so perfect. Done? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma Question. Yes, ma Who is sitting left of A? E, ma'am. E. No. F. 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 Yes. If A is facing towards the center, this is the right side, now. This is the left side. Imagine. Is it okay? I just said if you're looking towards the center, right is anti-clockwise yes, so f is sitting on the left of it yes ma'am ma who is facing h e b e. e is facing h who are the neighbors of b d and, d and, h. D and, h. D and h any doubt no, no ma'am no ma'am ma'am yeah. yes ma'am i can't understand the second uh, hint given in this question, ma'am. No two but, ladies or gentlemen are sitting side by side? Yes, ma'am. I can't understand. A, B, C, D are the ladies. So, like the other three, E, F, G, H will be gents. So, A, B cannot sit together because they are both ladies. So, in my first line, in the first sitting which I made, I made a error now because two ladies are sitting together in that arrangement. Yes, ma'am. That's why that was it. So, in this case, if you notice, there are alternate. Yes, ma'am. Got Thank it? Thank you, ma Yes, ma'am. Guys, any doubts? Anyone? No, ma'am. No, ma'am.
आंसर गाइस आंसर वेल मैम 13 14 14 Let's. Thirteen. There are twenty-eight persons. Paul is twelfth from the right side. So there are already eleven people there. Eleven people are already on the right side of Paul. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. One is P. Paul itself. So we are already having twelve people. Till here, it's okay. Yes, ma'am. Fourth from the left. Fourth from first, second, third, and this is Paul. So three more people. Yes or no, guys? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma ma so we yes, already have fifteen people. So in order to make it twenty-eight, how many more do we need? Thirty. Thirty. Understood. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma Everyone clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Try this. These are some of the first basic questions. Then we'll talk about sitting arrangement. Twenty-three. Sorry. Twenty-three. Twenty-five. Yes. Some boys are sitting in a row in one row. P is sitting fourteenth from the left. If P is sitting fourteenth from the left, so there are already thirteen people here, and one is P. Do you all agree? Yes, ma'am. Q is seventh from the right. So on from the right side, there were six people, and then there was Q. Any problem? No, oh, ma'am. No, ma'am. So total, how many? Wait, one four more. Queen. There are four boys between P and Q. So plus four. So 25. how many total? Twenty-five till now. Yes, ma'am. Anyone has any doubt, guys? Ma'am. No, ma'am. Let me know if you are facing a problem. लेफ्ट ऑफ रीना दिस मीन इफ रीना इज योर I am taking immediate left. If there, I'll face a contradiction. I'll shift. Shikha is to the left of Reena. Manju is to the right of Reena. Yes. Reena is between Reena and Manju. So this was wrong. Contradiction shifting. So here it's Reena. Yeah, right. No, if they would have said immediate right, then I had to place Manju there. But they just said left and right. 
So I put immediate left and right. As soon as I saw that there was a contradiction, I shifted. Because left does not mean immediate left and right does not mean immediate right. It can be any position on the left side and the right side. For Shikha, I did not see a contradiction, so I did not move. But for Reet, Manju, I saw a contradiction. They said, first I placed Manju on the immediate right side of Reena. But then they said that Rita is sitting in between Reena and Manju. So I had to shift Manju to the more right side. Yes, Achai. I will look at photograph kill a better to face the new over. Who said that I said you over? If nothing is said, you always take this position. Okay. So, who would be second from the left in the photograph? This is left first, second. Okay, the person is clicking the photo from here. So for that photographer, this is the left and this is the right. The who will click the photograph? Na? The person will click the photograph. So for him, whatever the left and right is, that is what will be visible in the photograph, right? I the way they are sitting is not how the photo will come. Just imagine that you are standing in the line and the person in front of you is clicking the photograph. So your photo will show the left and right according to the person who is seeking the photograph. Yes or no? Yes, ma'am. All of you clear? They are looking that side. Mm -hmm. So the photographer is here. And he is looking this side. So for the photographer, this is the left side and this is the right side? Yes, ma'am. There are yes. two points of view. When you're sitting, you're sitting this side. So this was left and this was right when you were sitting. But now when the photo is getting clicked, it is on the point of view of the photographer. So for the photographer is in the opposite side. So the left and right turns. So from the left side in the photo, which one is the second position? Understand no, what the photographer was on the other side. Then the persons will also be facing on the other side. Right? No. He won't yes, take their back. Right? Guys, clear? Yes, ma'am. All this question I'm discussing because they're all one of a kind. If you weren't supposed to know this. That's why I gave you this question. These okay, are not repeat this part a lot, ma'am. See, when you were making them sit, they were sitting from the left and right of their position. So they were looking upwards. So this was the left side and this was the right side. So according to that, we made the four person sit. Now, if a person is gonna take their photograph, he's gonna take their face photograph, right? So the photographer has to be standing here. Yes, ma'am. And he's looking in the opposite side, he's looking towards them. So his left and right is the opposite of them? Yes, ma'am. So the way he will click the photograph is actually the left and right, right? So from his left, who is sitting on the second position? Rita, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Everyone clear? Yes, ma'am. Guys, any doubt? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Okay, ma'am. Okay.
let's see there are five different houses a to e in a row in a row okay so nothing mentioned they are all looking that side this is the right side this is the left side clear yes ma'am first a is to the right of b nothing mentioned so e may be in the any right position right now i'm taking the immediate right if i face a problem i'll shift a is to the immediate right of b press e is to the left of c and right of a and is referring to the first person so and refers to whom e yes and always refers to the first person so and is referring to e so e is on the left of c and e is on the right of a clear yes ma'am so e is on the left of uh, right of c a and on the left of c yes ma'am clear b is to the right of d so definitely this is the setting arrangement any problem guys no ma'am so no, whose no. house is in the middle a <clears throat> clear guys yes, any no. doubt no ma'am इन मार्च पास सेवन पर्सन आर स्टैंडिंग इन अर so seven seats left side right side yes looking this way q is standing left of r my fault if they are looking here this is right this is left q is standing left of r but right to p is this part okay Yes, o is standing yes, right to n, and and means o. O is left to p. O is left to p, and right of n. Agree? Yes, ma'am. S is standing right to r. S is standing right to r, and and refers to the first person. So S is left to t. S is left to t. s is on the left side of t so all the conditions were satisfied by immediate left and right no contradiction so who is standing in the middle q q, q. any doubts no ma'am no, sure yes question number 6 no 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 thank you answer 
five children are sitting in a row. S is sitting next to P but not T. S is sitting next to P but not T. So maybe on the left, maybe on the right side. Yes? Yes or no? Yes. Yes, ma'am. But not T. K is sitting next to R. Who is sitting on the extreme left? Who is sitting on the extreme left? Okay. R. R is sitting on the extreme left. So we already know this. And K is sitting next to R. Yes, ma'am. T is not sitting next to K. So T is not sitting here. Ma'am, there are only five children. He is not sitting here. So, it will be either PST or it will be TSP. One of it? From K cannot sit next to. Next to. That is what I am rule of. K is sitting next to R who is sitting on the extreme left and T is not sitting next to so this won't happen. Yes, PT. Okay. It can be either this or this. Two options. Yes? yes. S is sitting next to P but not T. So this cannot happen. So this is the only possibility. Yes, ma'am. Clear? So who are sitting adjacent to S? A, Clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Seven. Rashi. 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 Five girls are sitting in a row. Rashi is not sitting to Sule adjacent to Suleka or Abba. Okay. Anradha is not sitting adjacent to Suleka. Rashi is adjacent to Monica and Monica is at the middle. Monica is here. Yes? Yes, ma'am. Monica is here. Then? Okay. Rashi is adjacent to Monica. So, Rashi can be here. Agree? Or Rashi can be? These are the two options. Yes, ma'am. Any doubts still here? No, ma'am. Next. Rashi is not adjacent to Suleka or Abha. So here, in this position, neither Suleka nor Abha. So who is re remaining? Anuradha? Yes, ma'am. Anuradha. Agree? Yes, ma'am. Anuradha is not adjacent to Sulekha. Done. So two persons are left. Sulekha and Abha. Abha. So where will they be? Rashi is not. Anuradha is not adjacent to Sulekha. Done. Rashi is adjacent to Monica. Monica is in the middle. Mom, they're asking who is sitting next to Anuradha. So, Anuradha. So, we don't even need to fill out the next position. So, Anuradha yes. has to sit with Rashi. Agree? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma we still don't know the order. Eight. Alok. Alok. Alok, ma'am. Five friends or five positions. They are standing in a row facing south. This side. If the person is facing here, this is the left side. This is the right side. Agree? Yes, ma'am. Jayesh is to the immediate right to Alok. Jayesh is to the immediate right to Alok. If Alok is sitting here, not through that reference. I'm just sitting. They are looking in this side. Immediate right. Which position? Yes. 
yes any doubt guys amma oh, amma so both is between jayesh and pramod jayesh so both and pramod done yes sir Yeah. my mother looking this way pramod is between bhagat and subodh pramod is between bhagat and subodh so here will be bhagat five friends done all of them are looking this way left right who is on the extreme left end hello hello done yes ma'am yes ma'am any doubts guys Bob. Yes. No. Mom. 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 Yes, Purvi. Mom, I have a doubt, Mom. Uh, to the extreme left is is it the left of the question or our left? No, the way they are sitting, with reference to the people. So according to the question, Mom. Sorry. According to the question, the uh, yes. Uh, according to the okay. question, the direction that they are sitting or that which is the left side. Not our left or right. Okay, ma'am. Mom, I have a question. When they say Subodh is between Jayesh and Pramod, how do we know it's in that order? It can be between Pramod and Jayesh. Already also. knew that Jayesh was sitting on this side. So if he Subodh has to be in between, Jayesh is already sitting on its left side. So Pramod has to be on the other end. If they, if I did not know that, then it could be the other way round. Okay, mom. Thank you. Any other doubt, guys? Ma, immediate right means the next person. There is no. Just next, next seat. Okay, mom. Answer. So both. So both. So both. So both. Isn't this this? Good. Same question. The only the option is who is in the middle. So both is in the middle. Yes, yes, ma'am. Yes. New question. A, B, C, D, E, F, and G are sitting on a wall, and all of them are facing east. They are all looking this side, east side. So this is left, and this is right. Do you all agree? Yes, ma'am. Yes, yes. ma'am. D is sitting third from the south end. Means first, third. second, third. D is your. Yes. Any doubt? Yes, ma'am. No, ma'am. Mm. C is on the immediate right to D. C will be your. Yes, ma'am. Hmm. B is at the extreme end and has E as its neighbor. So B cannot sit in the below position because then it cannot have a neighbor. So B is sitting here and E is the neighbor. Yes, ma'am. Any doubt still here? Yeah? No. G is between E and F, so E is already here. G has to sit here, then F. Only yeah. one seat remaining, one letter remaining. That's it. Clear? Yes, ma'am. So we are sitting on the right side of E. None of these. None of these. None of these because G is sitting. Answer is G. So none yes. of these. Any doubts, ma'am? No, ma'am. Yes, they have not told about E and O, ma'am. Only one seat was remaining. Huh? After I made everyone sit, there was only one seat that was left. So he has to sit in that position. Ma'am, uh, why can't F be uh, in the place where C C is there? 
G is between E and F. Okay, ma'am. Fourth option, fourth condition. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Same question, I guess. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Two extreme ends. A, B. A, B. A, B. A, B. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Same question. Name the person who should change places with C so that he gets the third place from the north end. G. G. From the north. One, two, three. That means G has to swap places. Agree? If C wants to go to the third place from the north, north is up. So third place, G is occupying. So C has to swap places with G. Yes, ma'am. Any doubt? Sorry. G. Immediately between which of the following pair of people is D sitting? A C. D sitting. A C. A C. A C. F C. C F F F F C and F, no? D is sitting between C and F. Yes or no? Yes, yes ma'am. Ma D is sitting between C and F. Any doubts? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Everyone clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Answer. India. Australia. The flag of six nations have flown on the Mars in the following year. The flag of America was to the left of Indian tricolor. Suppose America and India left side. I'm just taking immediate left. If I face a problem, I'll shift. And and means what? First person. So, America is to the right of France. America is to the right of France. Agreed? Yes, ma'am. The flag of Australia was on the right of Indian flag. But left of Japan. Yes? Which was on the left of China. Which means which person? Immediate Japan. person. Who, who's our immediate persons. So, Japan is on the left of China. Clear? Yes, ma'am. So, in the center, we have India and Australia. Okay. In the center, we have India and Australia. Any doubts? No, ma'am. Everyone clear? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma Answer? By Taylor and Cook. Taylor and Cook. Are sitting around the table. That means? Round table? Yes, ma'am. Nothing said. So they are all looking towards each other? Right side, left side, right side for this person. Done? Mr. A sits opposite to cook. So you can sit anywhere, right? Suppose A is sitting here, the cook will sit here. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Next. C and D sits opposite. Any way wrong? Yes. Yes, ma'am. So this will be definitely be the cook. Do you all agree? 
Do you all agree? Yes, ma'am. Next. B is barber. So A cannot be barber. Agree? A cannot yes. be barber. If B, B is a cook. If B is sitting next to the barber, right of barber, so A cannot be the barber. Agree? Yes, yes or no? B sits on the right side of barber. So C is the barber. Or the barber sits here. Basically. I'm not sure whether C and D, but I'm sure about the barber's position. Guys, any doubt till here? Oh, ma'am. The washerman is on the left of the tailor. So the washerman oh. will be here. The tailor will be here. The washerman is on the left of the tailor. Ma'am. Yes. B sits right to the barber, ma'am. So to the barber's right should be B, no, ma'am. It should be opposite. Yeah. For this position, this is right and this is left. Okay. Yes. Got it. Is it clear? Yes, ma'am. So A and B. A is the tailor. B is the cook. Tailor and cook. Done? Yes, ma'am. 12. Q. Facing the center. How many persons? Five. Five. So no one is sitting opposite to anyone. If there are odd number of people, you cannot sit opposite to anyone. Yes? All facing towards the center. R is immediate left of T. So if T is sitting here, R has to sit here. Any yes, doubt? Yes, P is between S and T. So P has to be here. S has to be here. Any doubts? Uh -huh. Q, the only position remaining. Who is on the immediate left? Q? Same question. Can we dispense any of the uh, condition? No. Dispense means if you omit any of the option, this is the first condition, second and third. If you omit any of the condition, is there any such condition that does not affect our answer? It is just written. We don't even need that relation. Does any of the condition can be scraped off? No, ma'am. So every condition gives you an information which is very vital. So none of the condition can be dispensed. That means can be omitted. Because if you omit any of the condition, I'll be stuck. Clear? Yes, ma'am. So yeah, none of the conditions. None of the conditions. Then can you again repeat this alone? Dispense means can you omit any of the condition and still get the same answer? No, ma'am. No, that is what they are asking. Okay. Answer, guys. C, ma'am. Option C. Okay, let's see. Six people. So they'll sit opposite. Yes. Facing the center. So right anti-clockwise, left clockwise. A is facing D. 
क्लियर सी इज बिटवीन ए एंड बी ओके एनी वेर C is between A and B. F is between E and A. Two possible answers are there, ma'am. C is between A and B. E. F is between E and A. This is a possibility. Yes, ma'am. F is between E and A. C is between A and B. Any one can be possible. Who yes, is immediate left of B? It can be C or D. B or C. One second. So cannot be determined. Cannot be determined because it can be either D, ah, uh, which position immediate left. Yes. Either C or D. Anyone. Right. Either C or D. One of the option had to be there. Yes. One of the two options had to be there. Clear. Any doubts, guys? Till now. Okay.